Freemans is both honored and excited to offer the extraordinary collection of Sidney Rothberg in a series of auctions, beginning with What Do You See? on February the 27th at Freeman's Sale Room, 2400 Market Street, Philadelphia. For further details, please go to our website, www.freemansauction.com. My dad was one of the most fascinating people that I've ever met. He made art and antiquities come to life. How would I describe this collection? Intriguing, intimate, complex. My dad started collecting in his 20s, and some of these works haven't been seen for 60 to 80 years. It spans all centuries, <laughs> all continents, it's all forms. He was an art savant. There's an Avery that is quirky and cool. There's a Wesselman that's fabulous. It's provocative and sexy. The Renoir teapot, it's got quiet elegance and it's got a story. And my dad loved the story because Renoir started as a ceramics painter. The thing that my dad loved most was how everything was interconnected. He loved the inflection points. When artists were becoming who they were, he wanted to understand that moment. He was a soldier in World War II in Paris, and all of a sudden, people started to approach him with unbelievably beautiful works of art. They were trying to sell him these as an American soldier. Of course, he wouldn't buy them because one, he didn't have any money, but two, they were being looted actually. He didn't know what he was looking at. He just knew that it grabbed him. So when he got back to Philadelphia, every moment he could, he went to the Philadelphia Library on the Parkway and he literally devoured every artist book that they had. And that's how he started his encyclopedic knowledge about art and artists. Tell me what do you see is just so ingrained into me. Anyone that knew my dad would know that phrase. He was so infatuated with how people perceived a work or an antiquity. He wanted to know, what did you see? What did you think? How did that touch your heart? Where did your eye go? What did you love about it, hate about it? Would you want to collect it? Over the series of many auctions, we're going to be unveiling these gems. They're very personal to me, but I think that it's important that the world gets to see these treasures and love them and live with them and then share them with other people. I felt a responsibility to give them back to the world. <laughs>